The Bonneville Flats stretch far and wide across this superheated landscape. Mostly, they're deserted. But a few times a year, they play host to those for whom speed is a way of life. Chevrolet's Corvette was the first American mass-produced sports car with a glass fibre body. And that body was radically styled. The US car makers have always had a good line in engines. This one, proudly displayed through the bonnet, is a supercharged alloy V8 putting out 638 horsepower. And while that helps on the straight-line record runs, the Corvette has, in the past, given the impression of lacking capability in the swervy bits. So I'm going to have to find some bends to check out how good the current range-topping $107,000 Corvette actually is. It's civilised to drive at low speeds, even a trifle sedate. That does mean one can pootle around town and not scare the locals. But open up the throttle, and the car is transformed. A ride that is jiggly and not that precise at low speeds becomes composed at higher ones. And the noise? Well, there is enough to make you remember that what you're driving is really just a massive engine with a few other bits attached.